Hey guys, welcome back to The Fun Family. So today's video is going to be kind of like a room refresh for my girls. If you're new here, I do have three girls. Aurora, who is three, Layla is seven, and Jade is about to be six months as I'm filming this. So I'm gonna be working in Aurora and Layla's room. They both share a room. They have a trundle bed. I'll take you guys there in a second so you guys can see it. But I say a room refresh because for the most part, the room is decorated how I want it, but I'm going to be changing just a few things such as their bedding. I'm going to change all of that out. So their comforter, their pillowcase, their sheet, all of it. And then the main thing that I am going to be working in there on is their closet. I want to take off their closet doors and do like an open closet situation. So I plan on getting like a new dresser in there. Um, updating their hangers that way it's like aesthetically pleasing that way the closet can just be open and look nice so those are my main goals for their room so I'm gonna go ahead and take you guys in there so you guys can see like the before kind of how I have things in there right now and then I'll give you guys like my game plan so here is the girls room so this is their bed I get so many questions on this bed every single time I show it unfortunately it's really hard to find it's almost always out of stock they only restock it like two times a year so i will try to link it if i can down below i'll try to link like everything down below that way you guys can shop their entire room but that is their bed so it is a trundle bed so layla who is my older girl she sleeps on this one and then aurora sleeps on the bottom bed so i'm going to be updating their bedding so that is their bed they have this little um cubby shelf right here that has books i'm not going to be changing anything on this side right here because i really like the way it turned out so here is their closet this is the main thing that i want to work on today so i want to take off these doors i love having the mirror in here that way i can take like pictures with the girls and I can like see my outfit for the day because this is the only full length mirror we have in our house. But these doors suck. We actually already have this side off because the track ended up breaking. And these doors just, they just are not it, you guys. They stink, especially with children. They're hard to open because they get stuck sometimes so the girls are not able to open their own closet they come off the tracks constantly and then we're having to put it back on and it's just terrible they do not work for us so i plan on converting their closet into an open closet so i'm going to take off this side too and then this is what their closet currently looks like they have a ton of stuffed animals you guys they have so many so i need to find a storage solution for all of these stuffies and then I think I want to get like some decorative baskets, put them up here for extra storage. I also want to change out all of their um, plastic hangers. I think I'm going to donate these because they're still in really good condition so somebody else can use them. I also just ordered a new dresser for them. This one is still in really good condition so I'm going to just store it in the garage because when Jade is old enough she is actually going to share a room with Aurora. And then Layla's going to have her own room. So this is eventually going to be just Layla's dresser. But for now, Layla and Aurora share it. But I actually just ordered a new dresser for them. So that should be coming in a couple of days. And then this side of the closet has some more clothes up here. This is like all of their jackets and sweaters. They have their laundry basket. And then just like this... Um, little like rolling cart that has some old shoes that i need to go through donate them so i just need to clear out this closet update a few things and just convert it to an open closet but for now i am going to change out all of their bedding so the bedding they have now i absolutely love these blankets they're so nice they're from target i'll try to link them down below but they are like two years old now the inside is lined with Sherpa, so they're really nice for the winter time. But now that we are slowly transitioning to hot weather, hi <laughs> baby, now that we're transitioning to summertime, these blankets are just way too hot right now. So I bought 
thinner blankets that are also from Target. Here's the new bedding that I bought them. So these are their sheets and pillowcases. They're really pretty. The pink matches perfectly with these blankets so that way I can also use this blanket come winter and then like rotate the sheets out because they'll just match perfect. So it's just a light pink and then it has flowers all over it. I thought they were just so pretty. And then these are the like blankets that I went with. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop these in the wash and then whenever they are done washing, I'm going to switch out all of their bedding. So here is their new bedding. It's definitely very bold, so it's gonna take some time to get used to, but I think it turned out so cute. These blankets are really soft, the quilts, so I think it'd be perfect for summer, and they match so good in here with the tassels that they have. Their sheets are so pretty too. I think the little floral print is so cute compared to just a plain quilt. So that is her beds so i will see you guys in a few days whenever the rest of their stuff comes in so that way i can start working on the closet what baby what's the matter everybody can hear you you say hi <laughs> so benny's building the new dresser some progress right now. Yeah, the girls' closet is a mess. We gotta clean that up. Yes, <laughs> their closet is crazy. I kind of already showed you guys what's in it, but it's just like very, very messy. dresser is in so I'm gonna start putting the girls clothes back in here so the way I had the other dresser set up was there was four drawers so I had the top one was like a random drawer with like bathing suits um, Disney hats just like totally like random things and then the next one was Layla's and then it was Aurora's and then it was leggings but the way I had their drawers I had their underwear 
socks and pajamas all in one but now that we have more drawers i'm gonna do like this side aurora that side layla and then i'll do the top one like just socks and underwear the middle one i'm going to do pajamas and then the bottom one like their leggings So all of their clothes is now put away. So all of the drawers are filled. So the top one, like I said, is underwear and socks. And if you're wondering where I got these dividers from, they're from Amazon. I'll link them down below in the description. And then the middle one is pajamas. And then the bottom one is like leggings, jeans. So that is their dresser. So now I'm going to start working on their clothes. I want to take down all of these plastic hangers and replace them with some wooden ones that I bought. That way it matches the knobs on the dresser. I forgot to film it, but we did switch out these knobs. So I'm going to go ahead and start working on their clothes now. I'm not sure if I bought enough hangers, so we're going to have to see. But I'm going to just go ahead and start taking things down now. On the run from my given disaster Speed away from the holy mind Pride That's where I never thought it would matter If I'm gone by now All my weakness keep on linger, linger on On repeat like it will be my favorite song Oh, I know I should be moving, moving. I definitely underestimated how many hangers I need so I'm gonna have to place another order off of Amazon to get some more because I still have all of this and then the girls is like sweaters and jackets over here so I'm gonna have to put that on hold and finish that another day whenever I get those in so I'm gonna go ahead and work on the other stuff that's going in the closet so I have a hamper that I need to put together that I'm gonna put on this side and then I bought this little rattan basket from Target. I'm gonna put it on the other side of their dresser and then I bought the girls some like throw blankets for whenever like it's a chilly night and they're gonna store them in this basket whenever they don't need them. So basket on one side, hamper on the other side. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those together. On, but you got me. Pretend, keep on driving and driving along the road tonight. As my head don't feel my spark between the jars and bottle jug, just me and all the red lights. Keep on driving and driving. As far as all of these stuffed animals go, I'm gonna try to fit them in this like bean bag thing that I bought off of Amazon. So it's pretty much just a giant um, bean bag like cover. I got the beige rose print, so I think it'll match perfect in here. I'm gonna try to fit as many stuffies as I can. The girls have a ton. A lot of them have sentimental value, so the girls have trouble like getting rid of them. So we're gonna try to fit as many as we can. It's pretty much the girls' bedtime, so they're over here in jammies, but they wanna help me with this part. So I'm gonna let them just go to town on it and try to fit as many as they can in here. What if we can fit 900? <laughs> okay, so here's the opening. Whoa. You guys are gonna try to fit them all in there, okay? I'm gonna start just taking them down, okay? Okay. Ready? Wait, 
That's what the top of the closet is looking like now. We were actually able to fit almost all of them. And there's still some room if we were to like shove some more in there. They would totally fit. So definitely recommend this. I think it's super cute. I think I'm going to stick this inside of the playroom. That way the girls have like an extra seat. Because I wouldn't really have any room to keep it in here. Unless I put it right there in the corner maybe. Because Aurora's bed pulls out. She has a trundle bed. So she sleeps on that obviously. So I can't really have this like laying out right here. It might fit right there. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to like play around with it. The only stuffed animals that I left out are these ones. Because these ones are pretty important. Benny gave me this one a while back. That balloon up there I got when I had Everly in the hospital. So that is really special. So that's why we keep that up there. Layla got this Build-A-Bear whenever Benny was in basic training, so that's very special. We just took the girls to their first Dodger game, so we have those up here. And then we had this made when I was pregnant with Everly. It has her heartbeat in it, so this is very, very special. So that's why that is up there. So the girls' room is officially done, so I'm going to take you guys in there. But first, I'm going to go ahead and show Aurora and Layla first. Okay, so Aurora's over there playing, so we're just going to show Layla first. You ready? Yeah. Okay, close your eyes. <laughs> One. Hold on, let me shut the door. Okay. One, two, three. I like it, I like it, I like it. And now for the final reveal. I'm really happy with how it turned out. I think it turned out amazing. So I'm gonna kind of walk you guys through what I did in here, like what I updated. So first I'm gonna take you through like the little things that I did in the room and then I'll show you the major part that I did, which is the closet. So over here, I just added this. I didn't really show it in the video, but this is new in their room. It's just like a little wooden bin from Target. That way the girls can keep all of their scrunchies in here because they have a lot. So I added that in here. The other thing that got added in here is this little like um, peg hook thing. That way the girls can hang their towels in here or they can hang like hats, their bags, whatever they want in here. For their beds, I changed all of the sheets, all of the blankets because their previous blanket that was on the bed was just more for like winter because it was a Sherpa blanket. And it gets really hot where we live, so their whole blankets needed to be updated. So they have this little quilt now, which is really thin. So that is updated. Changed their sheets to this floral print. It's in like a light pink color. I also added this little butterfly pillow to kind of tie in the colors because we have some of like that orange color over here going on and this is their closet now it looks so nice so it is completely open we took off 
the doors which were basically like giant mirrors we took off the track off the bottom so now it's just completely open and i think it looks so good now it is so like aesthetically pleasing if you guys remember this whole top part up here was just stuffed and like jam-packed with stuffed animals we did keep a few up here these are like sentimental ones i believe i did like talk you guys through like what is the meaning behind all of these so those are really special so that's why those are up there and then we have some baskets up here i do plan on getting some more just for storage so i actually do have stuff in these rainbow ones so this one up here has the girls' current um swimwear so that is up there and then this one has all of our like disneyland um ears that we wear whenever we go to the park i also changed all of the hangers previously the hangers that were in here were like um plastic bright pink and white but now they're all wooden that way it just looks super nice cohesive and it kind of like ties in the room because there's a bunch of like wooden accent pieces in here i also got this little tray from the target dollar section so just a little tray where they could put stuff on this is like Layla's favorite rock that she has so she just has that on the tray and then this was from one of our friends baby showers and i just think it's like such a cute candle so we have that on there the dresser is completely new so this side is aurora's this side is Layla's, and now it's like the perfect height it's just centered inside of the closet before i had that taller dresser that you guys saw and aurora wasn't able to reach like all of the drawers so now she can easily like grab all of the clothes herself which is really great because she's going through that toddler independent phase so i am not allowed to help her at all so it's really nice that she's able to get all of her clothes herself i changed out the hamper to this one so again to tie in like the wooden accent pieces and then this giant bean bag is actually filled with all of those stuffed animals that i took down from up there so highly recommend this if you are like us and your kids have like a million stuffed animals that they can't seem to part with highly recommend getting this we were able to fit so many in here there is so many and there's still room to stuff in here but it's just perfect it has a handle so you can easily carry this from room to room which is really nice because we like to have movie nights so this could be another seating option in the living room whenever we do that i also added this little basket over here it's like a little rattan basket i got this from target it is on the smaller end i didn't check the dimensions when i bought it but it still works out the blankets are kind of squished in here but it's totally okay it's not a big deal at all so there's one blanket in here for Layla, one blanket in here for Aurora. That way they can easily like grab it if it is on the cooler side at night. All right, well that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love how the room turned out. My vision came to life with the help of Benny. So thank you to him for helping me transform the girls' closet. This room is officially done. If you're wondering where something is from, I will always have the links down below in the description. So make sure you check that out. But as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the Moran family <laughs> and make sure you hit that bell. That way you guys always get notified every single time we upload. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye, Bye guys.